I would like to thank the Center for Strategic Studies under the President of the Republic of Azerbaijan for this book being published. Uh, my colleague Azar Gubanov, ex-colleague uh, Mr. Gubanov, also uh, provided their contributions to this book. And also we have to mention two specialists from Turkey, Turban Merdan and Turjan Yildiz, who also get, uh, made contributions to this uh, book. And this book uh, was prepared in the English language and published in Europe. And the purpose was to inform the international community and also the national government agencies, the offices, our representative offices, about the situation. And we used in this research, used the sources of many Great Britain scientific sources, uh, the works, the works of the academicians. We use the data, qualitative and quantitative data they provided to us. And we touch on this issue in this book, not only from the water point of view, but also from the point of view of the underwater, uh, sorry, underground and uh, surface resources and from other, all other sorts of aspects. And this situation, the topic is not uh, just covering the illegal activities and occupied territories of Azerbaijan and uh, contradictions uh, of this with the imperative norms of international law. But we also uh, included into this book the indirect, possible indirect influence of Armenia activities in Armenia on the other countries international, like the Metzimor nuclear power station and all other objects. So, so with the purpose of informing the uh, international community that despite the fact that different tax holidays uh, are announced by Armenia and for international investors, but they try to do their business. They do the business of the business as a business. And they have this notion in English. But it has a different side of it. And, and the UN, it has turned into an institution, corporate social responsibility institution within the UN itself. So when all are talking about the environment, about the social impacts, environmental impacts. So these factors have to be also taken into consideration. And we have tried to include all of this in this book. I don't think I need to go into details about all other aspects because they have been already uh, mentioned here. I just recommend you to read this book. I would like to recommend the expat foreigners to read it. And I think it will provide a great, uh, great uh, effect for you. And maybe you will be able to raise this with your own institutions. Uh, and then uh, the legal entities will know in your country if they uh, invest in Armenia, what it may result that they know these consequences, future possible consequences of their investments. Thank you very much.